Hey guys, Jeff the Nature Guy here on a wonderful snowy day at Zoo Montana and I want to take you into the life of our lynx because she is probably one of the most spoiled animals we have here at the zoo. Right now behind me you see Miss Mel. She's our volunteer extraordinaire, one of the main trainers on Fiersa. She's also the one that helped build that living wall inside the zoo so she is unbelievable. And what you're seeing her do is doing some training but some enrichment as well, some fun. So what you're going to see is you're going to see some video right now of her, of the Fiersa, the lynx, jumping. And I want you to see how high she can actually jump. She can jump upwards of six feet high. Now in the wild, that's going to help her, of course, when she hunts. Now mainly, these guys will hunt things like snowshoe hare, but occasionally they can actually jump up and catch birds right out of the air. It's just incredible to see. But what's so cool is to see this lynx in the snow. Take a look at what we just did with her earlier. She's actually out in the snow, out in the zoo having some fun with the trainers. And what we're doing is we're actually taking her on our walk. You take your dog on a walk, we take our lynx on a walk. And what we're doing is we're just giving her some good outside time, let her be a lynx in the snow. Look at how fast she is, and then look at how she uses her ears. What Mel's doing is she's gonna use a stick to actually play with fear, so just like you do with your cat at home. But what's so cool is Fiersa can actually sense and hear where the end of that stick is and you see her pouncing on it just like a cat does. Imagine she's hunting something like a mouse or a vole. That's exactly what she's going to do. She's going to jump up in the air, use her paws to grab it, get that mouth down there, and of course tear that mouse apart and have it for dinner. But it's just so neat to see her in her natural habitat, seeing how she works in the snow. She's got those giant feet. Of course, those giant feet spread out. We've said it before, just like snowshoes, helps them to walk in that deep snow and chase those very, very, very quick, quick snowshoe hairs that she likes to eat. But you can see just how fast she is, how well built she is for hunting. She is literally just like a machine and just does so well. But this is a great opportunity for us to get her out, <clears throat> give her some fun. It mentally stimulates her, meaning it keeps her from getting bored. And of course, because she is so uh, good with the trainers, it's good to get her out and good to get her, of course, doing what she loves to do. And that's just like you see stalking and running and doing all that fun stuff that lynx love to do out in the wild. So if you're lucky enough, you might actually get to see this yourself when you come to the zoo. So come on out here, enjoy yourself, and enjoy the zoo. So until next time, guys, I'm Jeff the Nature Guy. See you right back here at Zoo Montana.